What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 76 video. So in this one, we're basically going to be continuing on the Raider side of the story, the main story that is. Uh, within Wastelanders, hopefully we see some new and interesting NPCs and stuff like that. Uh, I'm basically prioritizing all of the main storyline first so that we can get a grasp at, you know, some of the changes that might have uh, happened or potentially happened within the main storyline of the game. I know you have your changes with the actual you know npc side of the story with the vault and everything and the gold bullion and everything but i i figured all of you guys have already seen it and i want to see the the whole uh main storyline side of wastelanders and see if anything changed i will be going through the whole settlers and raiders side of the story too uh but i'm prioritizing this for now so with that being said I'm done talking, let's go ahead and get into it, but first things first, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video, and subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's get on with it. Alright, so I think we have to go in that direction, yep, we have to go to the satellite, let's get my weapon, oh, so I haven't transferred it over, but I found online, uh, through Facebook, through a Facebook post or whatever, an individual that was selling a laser rifle for pretty dirt cheap dude that was uh it, it it was almost a perfect rifle for me uh it was one legendary effect that i wish was another vats enhanced thing or whatever um but it's an anti-armor and then uh something that had to do with vats i can't really remember exactly what it was but um, oh god that was an accident all right but uh yeah at some point i'm gonna switch it over so by the time the next video comes, I think I'm going to uh, have it on this character so that you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about with that weapon. It is a level like 45 or something, so I won't be able to use it for a good minute, but that's definitely going to be, uh, at least until I find the perfect laser rifle, that's going to be my main go-to weapon for a while. It's not an ultra sight laser or anything like that, but it's just uh, like a regular laser rifle, but it's still a pretty badass one to say the least. So I'm pretty excited to get to level 50 and actually use that rifle, man. But as of now, it definitely seems like it's going to be a while before I get to use it. And this gun is almost broken. Fuck me. So at some point, I'm definitely going to have to go fix it back at my camp. I think I'm going to get to this satellite place um honestly i might be able to get through this part without even firing a shot so after i do this part i'm definitely gonna fast travel back to my camp and uh hopefully i have enough to fix this i kind of wish i had some of the perks necessary to like double improvement essentially and also um uh, like gun, what is it, gun nut or whatever, gunsmith, whatever, that allows you to, like, have your weapons, you know, the durability just lasts longer. Or the condition just goes, like, the wear and stuff goes down a little bit slower. But, um, we're definitely far from end game build with this character, so I'm expecting to do a lot of fixing up with this character man oh god freaking firecrack berry scare the shit out of me sometimes all right we're definitely already here so i'm pretty sure we can uh get there without having to fire a single single round but first things first let's go ahead and do some sneaking and at least discover this place there we go and then i'll do some sneaking can i open this no fuck all right so let's go up here and go around. All right, sneaky, sneaky. Luckily, I already know exactly where it's at because I've done this before. Obviously, it's literally way down there. But there's a super mutant in this place. Now, I'm not trying to get caught up right now. So not with the durability or the condition to my weapon being pretty low and it being a laser rifle i mean these things condition go down pretty freaking fast all right let's go wait i'm gonna have to go in there anyways huh fuck man i, yeah, I do 
I hope he's not super strong. Let's see. Oh, he's only a level 10. I should be able to take him out. Oh, God. Let's hopefully get these two guys... Shit. Run! Hopefully these two guys fight each other. Come on, please. And I don't have any grenades to throw either. Oh, I do have grenades. Is there somebody behind me? Who the hell shot me? Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Am I going to have to destroy that? those damn robots? Speaking of robots, where the hell are they? Oh, they're down there. What? I hear something. Um, let's get the Molotov cocktail. Pretty sure that's not gonna do anything to them. Dude, one of them is a level 26. Let's get that super mutant down here. You! There we go. Come on. Little baby scared? Uh, yeah, and I kind of have every right to be. Hopefully, the robots and that super mutant fight each other. Why isn't he moving? Is he bugged? I think he's bugged. Uh, all right, let's go with single shots. Oh god, that did almost nothing to him. Alright, got some sneak attack damage. You can smell me all you want, broski. Did he move? Where is he? At least he's finally coming down. Well, I spoke too soon. Maybe it'll be better if I go this way. Shit, dude. Oh, God. What? How did that not hit him? Alright, he's right there. Come on. Yes, your arm. That's doing almost no damage. I wish I was still in sneak. But I'm not. It's thanks to those stupid robots. Their perception is through the roof, it looks like. Come on, where are you going? Dude, I just got him in the head. Can you guys please fight each other, man? I mean, I think they're they're shooting at him. So there's that. Oh, he's done skis, bro. Haha. <laughs> All right. Now I got to find a way to get to these little guys down here. Where are they? Oh, there's one right there. Oh god. You know what? Run! Pretty sure I could do this super fast. Come on, baby. Uh, auxiliary control. Divert auxiliary. Did I do it? Yes, I did. This is an emergency alert. It's the end of the world, and we're all fucked. I'm glad you acknowledged that. <laughs> Talk. Full disclosure, I didn't think you'd succeed at getting my signal working. 
So I was just gonna kill you and take your stuff when you came back? If you came back at all, that is. Guess it'd be a real dick move for me to do that now. Yeah, a little Look, bit. I'm what you people would call a raider. <laughs> Killing, stealing, and cheating is kind of my shtick. And thanks to you, I've got a working radio. So I can reach other like-minded individuals and get them to join me. You've opened the floodgates. Hey, come see me at the top of the world when you get the chance. I've got something for ya, and I pinky swear I won't kill ya. Alright, sounds like a deal, but first, before I do that, I gotta go home. The thing that sucks about my camp, besides the obvious that it's a tiny little crappy camp, is that there seems to always be a freaking, like an NPC that's there that's always spawning. It's pretty annoying. Let's see if this is the case now. Um, it's just about oh. time to eat. Absolutely. Can I just kill her? Well, look at that. I've never seen that type of bird before. Time to test. <laughs> 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 well, uh, the answer is yes. All right. Do I even have a weapons workbench? Yes, I do. All right, modify and repair. Let's go ahead and fix my weapon. Um, inspect and repair. Workbench. Yes. Woohoo! Very nice. Let's take a nap too. Well, let's take a. Do I have any diluted? Um. Yes, I do. Oh fuck, that's Rad X. Right away. Let's see if that's um all I need. Yeah, that should be fine. Let's take a nap. I didn't mean to close my shutters. But right now I need to take a nap and uh, make sure my health is all the way up. Cause I'm kinda sort of uh low on health and I don't want to use a stim pack. This low uh or this early in the game I guess. I'm only at level 10, so this early in the game is kind of like tough to have uh, my health up. You know what I mean? Especially with that mutations. Like if I had a uh, healing factor, dude, I wouldn't even need to come back all the damn time. Because all I have to do is go into like, to hidden, and that's it. I'm done skis. But there's also a second plus, and that's the well-rested perk. That gives me a little bit more uh, XP, so there's that too. I love my I love my little bed right here, dude. Every one of my characters has this bed. I mean, come on now. Being a mare gamer, I mean, would would I use anything else? No. I mean, I guess I could, but I don't want to. Oh my god. We are finally full health. Well, as full as we can. I have a tiny little bit of radiation still, but definitely not a big deal. Alright, let's go ahead and fast travel back to the top of the world. Eight caps, don't mind if I do. That way we can talk to old girl up at the top of the world. <clears throat> we should hopefully I mean I wonder if there's any dialogue choices with her that would be pretty interesting that'd be really interesting actually I like that idea I guess we'll find out right now right once we actually get there We haven't had any dialogue choices with her yet, but now that we're meeting her in person, who knows? Sky's the limit, I suppose. Ah! I was trying to run with it uh, still loading in. All right, let's go. Is it this one? Yes. Observation, don't mind if I do. 
Rose, oh Rose. Hello. Huh. Well, this is a little awkward. Not what either one of us expected, eh? Anyway, to prove I'm not a monster, I scrounged up some old junk to give you as a reward. Thank you. Is that all you gotta say? Oh, hey, uh, I had something to say to you. Now, what was it? Uh, ah, right. So, wanna help me out again? Um, oh, dude, it does have dialogue choices. See, this is the kind of shit that I wanted to do the main storyline for. Uh, let me see. Tell me about the old raiders, the dead ones. My kind of people, we were hardcore. The originals, not these wannabes and losers who refuse to join up with me. We split into five gangs. Cutthroats, trappers, diehards, blackwater bandits, and the gourmands. Each one was special in their own way, except for the diehards. They were a bunch of boring losers. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, why should I help you? You almost backstabbed me. Almost. I almost backstabbed you, but clearly I didn't or you'd be dead. Point is, you're alive and stronger for it because of me. Did I even get a thank you for that? No. Imagine we had a boss fight with Rose. That would be fucking hilarious. Uh, you are one delightful, uh, delightfully murderous ro little robot. I'm a robot? Oh, wait. I knew that. Anyway, <laughs> you say the sweetest things. Plus, you got that whole one-person army thing going for you. Thank you. So, I mean, I guess I'm game. How can I help you? So, the old bands of raiders each have their own, like, pet projects or whatever. You know, to be all special. If I'm ever going to rebuild a raider army, I need to figure out which of these crazy tactics actually work. We both win. I get answers, and you get a new toolbox full of scary things you can use to terrify your enemies and gross out your friends. Cool. Um... You know there's already a raider army around? In Crater? Are you seriously calling Meg's bunch of losers an army? <laughs> <laughs> Please. Those blood eagles, maybe. But they're not my type. Uh... Sign me up for Rose's army. Can you say best day ever? <laughs> Or at least this week, because uh, that chem trip last Thursday, oh, man, whoa. Tell you what, you help me out, and you can consider yourself a super secret member of my Raider gang, so, uh, shh. <laughs> oh, dude, that's sick. All right, uh, tell me about these tactics. We'll start with my personal favorite, Karma. No, not that new age bullshit. I'm <laughs> talking about a chem that hits hard but leaves you reeling. My cutthroat friends figured out a way to weaponize it. I'm gonna lend you my old syringer, and you're gonna modify it to shoot karma darts! <laughs> Just bring it back, or I'll find you and kill ya! <laughs> Seriously. Not joking! I really will. Dude, I will destroy you. Look at me getting a bunch of stuff. Let's listen to this. Wait, hold on. Flavors of mayhem. Uh, Rose wants me uh, wants someone to try some raider tactics. Okay, let's listen to this. Hey, turn it off. You want my wife to find out about us? Oh, come on. I want to make a recording of us. You said you were gonna ditch that old hag when we got back anyway. <laughs> Fine, but it goes with you when we leave. And you need to promise to destroy it if word ever gets out about us. I have too much to lose in a divorce, and leaving evidence like that laying around will only make it worse. Aw, don't be an old stick in the mud. No one's gonna find out. Pinky swear. Uh, hey, you got any more of those chems with you? Uh, yeah, yeah, what do you want? Day tripper? Help yourself. Uh, just don't take too much. Don't, uh, get addicted. Yes, sir. Input received, sir. Awaiting orders. <laughs> okay, I get it. You're not a robot. I 
know you don't like it when I order you around like that. You're my darling Rose. I just don't want anything bad to happen to you. Oh, baby. You're going all soft on me now. <laughs> you know I love you. Mwah! Hey, do you want to hit the slopes? Or do you maybe have something else in mind? <laughs> all right, you little minx. Now, you really have to turn off the recorder. <laughs> well, looks like this person right here and the person in the huddle tape have the same voice. And one of them was Rosalind, the other one was Rose. Gee, I wonder. Uh, Madigan's corpse, investigate remains. Oh, I see now. You're here about that guy, huh? Mm -hmm. well, good luck getting anything out of him. He's been dead a while. Um... What happened to Madigan? He came up here to negotiate with my Raider associates. They strung him up and left him to die after convincing him to spill the beans about what he was up to. Before you ask, I don't know. I wasn't there. I find that hard to believe. And you just kept him up here in the cage? I didn't put him there. That was the previous tenants. They were real slobs. You know, I keep meaning to find a maid service, but who has the time, right? You're a Miss Handy. <laughs> all right, uh, all right, Miss Nanny, a Miss Handy. What the fuck is a Miss Handy? All right, uh, Madigan found something, a quote unquote game changer. What was it? Who knows what goes through their dopey responder brains? Can you imagine going through life a hundred percent chem free? <laughs> Anyway, you're probably looking for that scorch detector uplink thingamajiggy was trying to install when they caught him. Yep. Seems real handy. I know where it is, but I'm not ready to talk. But maybe if you help me out, I'll trust you enough. Well, all right then. <clears throat> so let's go and install this thing. We have to go into the middle place now. Add karma, syringe barrel to uh, mod. Um, team only interior. Cool, that changed. So, only you and your teammates can be in this interior. Friends and strangers can't join you. Uh, make important story choices that have large consequences. Progress, uh, progress is saved less frequently when in a solo interior. Be sure your quest has checkpointed before leaving will do so this wasn't a solo area before and now it is i wonder if it looks any different i'll be keeping an eye on you from up here i can see just about anything with my robot eyes and these viewfinders and lucky you since you helped me tap into the emergency broadcast system you can hear my lovely voice from anywhere <laughs> well it did change slightly where'd he go there he is oh god oh my god Maybe I should run. Run! Holy shit. Oh! Why are they exploding? I hope I freaking spot in here. <laughs> well, I did, so there's that. And I'm almost level 11. Let's go ahead and reload. Come here, homie. You're done. Wait, where are they at? Holy shit, this guy was level 14. Oh god. I need to be careful, man. There's a lot of them. I mean, chances are I'm still gonna die regardless. Oh, hello. Where are they at? No, not you. There's gotta be someone else closer. Right there. Don't kill me! Oh, shit! Run away! D 
Dear God. <clears throat> Die, please. Thank you. Stim pack. Yes, please. <clears throat> Holy shit, dude. What the hell is going on here? There's a ton of them, bro. They're seriously kicking my ass here. Literally, the, I don't think my weapon's gonna make it very much longer. I think there's only a handful left. So there's that. What's going on? Are we good? Definitely not. Where was it that I died before? Hold on. Let's check this body. They all have freaking shotguns, bro. Alright, there's one guy up there. But I'm not worried about him right now. Right now, I want my junk. Wherever the hell my junk is. Over there. I see it. I can hear somebody walking around, too. I'm nervous. We should take this, uh, Nuka-Cola, cherry, just in case, because it does give me health. Alright, nothing. That's all I had? I'll be taking that, thank you very much. Is there anything else I need? I don't know. Let's go ahead and use this thing really quick. You know what, I could use that fragmentation grenade. Alright, so modify and repair. I gotta do Rose's Syringer. Well, first of all, don't want that. Alright. Is it a barrel? Karma. Now that you've got yourself some karma, it's time to see it in action. There's a mean old Mama Yagwai I like to call. Actually, strike that. I lost track of her a while back, so just make it so there's one less Yagwai to worry about. I don't care which one. If you can't find a Yagwai, find something else that's tough so you can see the karma in action. I know, I know, it sounds crazy to make a beast like that tougher and nastier, but once karma wears off, it'll be as weak as a newborn kitten. That's when you finish it off, <laughs> assuming you survived the initial effects. Have fun! If you say so. I kind of uh, need crystal again, though. So, alright, where's the freaking Yaogwai? There's one way out here. I could... I hear somebody walking. There he is. <gasps> Come on, baby. Hold on, let's uh... <laughs> Oh god, somebody else is coming though. I could use that level up, so I think I'm gonna kill him. Take both of those actually. Let's see if I win this. I've never won. And my losing streak will continue, it looks like. Yay, me! Alright. Because I don't think I'm gonna have enough durability on my weapon. Or, um, what's it called? Or ammo to be able to take out that Yaogwai. So before I do that, let me find this dude and kill him, though. <gasps> Where are you at? You're up here somewhere. I'm gonna kill you, bro. Just need you to understand this. Holy shit, dude. Woo-wee! Alright, let's go ahead and level up. Hopefully there's something good for me. Nothing here. Um. No. No. 
Nope. Ooh, there we go, gunsmith. I really hope this works with my weapon. Because if it doesn't, that sucks. But if it does, hell yeah. Alright, so where am I going? Um, I guess we'll fast travel here. It's since it's like really close and then I can just run there. This is probably going to be pretty difficult in all reality. I just can't remember if I actually have to kill the Yao Guai. Not quite sure. I don't remember. But, I mean, I suppose we'll find out shortly. Don't get burned. Yeah, I don't think I want to play uh that mode anytime soon. Like, the only time I ever plan on playing uh, Nuclear Winter again, because I'm already level 100. The only time I ever plan on playing, uh, plan on playing, uh, Nuclear Winter is if there's, like, so special events that happen from time to time. Is it this way? No. That way? Yes. Alright, let's go get this Yao Guai. Alright, let's go ahead and drink some water first. There we go. Some rad stags over there, too, but... I think I should have enough food. Now they'll... Here, you know what? I'll eat one of these for now. Actually, I'll eat two of them. So I'm fully... Wait, am I going the right way? Yes, I am. That way I'm fully fed and stuff. So we do have a pretty long trek. I hope I didn't mess this up again, dude. Because I've been messing up this build kind of... Insanely. Let me know down in the comments if you guys know if Gunsmith... Is it Gunsmith? Yeah, if Gunsmith works with uh, with laser rifles. I want to say it does, though. This is my first time doing a laser weapons build with uh, in this game. My main character is a... Uh, he's a sniper, but he uses like hunting rifles and stuff. Right now, I'm actually using a Gauss rifle. I think it's a pretty good weapon, so. This is going to be like an automatic, uh, I guess you could say stealth commando build. Which is something I've never done before. Even though in theory I could always do a stealth commando with my main character because uh, the commando perks are in perception. So that should be pretty interesting. What level does, uh, Commando come anyways? Alright, the Yagwai should be around... There he is, I see him. Let's go ahead and put Rose's Syringer here. Where's it at? Oh, right there. We'll actually put it on. Go! Is that it? <laughs> Stupid Yagwai. Well, you didn't chicken out and you didn't fuck up, so that's a win in my book. Now put that thing out of its misery so we can get to the next task. Oh yeah, I've got another task for you after this. Um... Dude, I'm gonna die. I'm screwed. Run! <laughs> I'm so screwed. Oh my god, I'm so screwed. No! <laughs> oh my god. I'm not religious, but... Help me, dear Jesus. That fire, that burning effect is working. Fuck. <laughs> Come on. Get over here. Did I win? I did. Word to the wise, that car.
karma stuff can backfire on you if you're not careful. And take it from me. You don't want to use it on yourself. Unless, you know, you're really confident you can kill everything around you before it wears off. Okay, next we've got explosions. <laughs> the trappers would rig up bait with explosives to take on some of the more dangerous game out there. I want you to go make some explosive bait and don't blow your fingers off in the process. You're not a robot like me. No replacement hands for you. Um, where the fuck did that Yao Guai go? First of all. Second of all, I'm out of ammo with my 44 pistol, and I'm also screwed with this gun. So I gotta go back to my camp. Luckily, I should. Wait a minute. Follow the overseer's journey. Let's go listen to this hollow tape. Since I can't find that freaking Yaogwai. Literally disappeared. Oh well. Not really, really worried about it. Probably only had some meat. And various other things. Alright, let's listen to this. Sure, I'll take some more water. Overseer's log. Missile silo alpha. No one's here. Not even any military survivors. It might be for the best. I don't think Bolt Tech asserting jurisdiction over the nukes would have gone over well. But, also means I'm locked out. Access is restricted to the highest ranking officers. It's not going to be <laughs> easy to fool. If we can't secure these sites... My God. The automated factory in the silo? Just how many nukes can it make? Alright. That was a pretty, uh... Random holotape. So let's go back home. Luckily for us, I hope I, now, right now, I kind of just hope that we have acid. That way I could, uh, smelt some shit. Specifically some crystal. Alright, let me see, where's my camp? It's um, hard work making a living out here. Oh my god. Keep your eye out for danger. Didn't I just kill your friend? Watching. All right, let's put all this junk before I end up losing it. Um, yes. Also, crystal. Those raiders come snooping around. You're gonna regret it. Shut up, lady. Craft. It is the chemistry workbench, right? Smelting. Crystal son. Of a bitch. I got an idea. Um, where is it? Right here. This place has a ton. So before we continue on, we definitely have to go and get a ton of acid. Probably in between videos, this one and the next, uh, between this video and the next video, I'm probably just going to go take that place, Hemlock Holes, and just get a shitload of acid, man. Because I get the feeling that I'm going to need to be doing that quite often. Who is this? Shit. Well, I need to be careful because I don't have ammo and I don't have a laser rifle. Quietly. Run! I think we're fine. Seemed like they're, one of them was trying to be a mechanic and work on the freaking car though. It shouldn't be too far, right? Nah, it's not too far. But right now I'm in a very tough situation because I have a, my main weapon is broken. I definitely need a secondary weapon, like a plasma rifle. That'd be that'd be cool. <clears throat> yeah. So my main character is also collecting, uh, you know, fusion cells for this character as well. So my main character, whenever I'm not filming, he's pulling in work. He's putting in work for this character as well. But realistically too though, man, I really need to take advantage of the fact that, uh, like, that I don't make videos every day for this. Like, I do 
if, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I do every other day is a Fallout 76 video. Um, I do make three videos a day. So I'm thinking about doing, and I do it Monday through Friday, like uh, three videos a day, Monday through Friday. I'm thinking about reducing that to two videos a day, uh, but having two videos daily, every single day or whatever. Uh, but if that's the case, Fallout 76 videos would probably be every three days, but I mean, we'll, we'll be getting more videos more often, you know, so there's that. And per month, I think we're going to be losing two videos a month, which really isn't that much. It, well, realistically, it's nothing. But, yeah. Um, and if that's the case, man, I could probably just AFK some little bit of time or whatever over here at Hemlock Holes. And just get a shitload of freaking acid for this guy, man. Because this guy's definitely going to be needing crystal like crazy, dude. Just this video, I had to repair my weapon twice. That shit cray cray. That should be cray cray. All right, let me see. I got to be careful, though, because uh, for all I know, there's going to be like a bunch of raiders and shit all over the place. I think there's a grafted monster that spawns around here, too. All right, come on, baby. No, uh, no grafted monster, it looks like. So that's good. All right, I'm not worried about you right now, bro. Well, I'll do your freaking miscellaneous quest some other time. Right now, I'm on an acid hunt. All right. Oh, there's the grafted monster. What level is he anyways? Ten. <laughs> oh, fuck. I totally forgot I have to clear this bitch, don't I? All right, hopefully I have... Enough ammo to clear this place. Oh, come on. What? what is, what's wrong with him? <laughs> I shot him the first time. He just went freaking full crazy. Oh, my God. Stop moving, damn it. No, oh, fuck. Can you fucking die? Holy shit, dude. Alright, what can I do? Let's go into hidden so I can snipe this other dude. Anybody over here? No. Let's hide behind this thing. Dude, he just took a bullet to the knee. Wait, is that it? Was that everybody? How, why did I get 20 caps? I think it's because I cleared this place. Let's take this. Alright, I'm down. I, uh, while we're waiting, let's go ahead and uh, read all the plans. Recipe diluted rat -X? I didn't even know I had that. Diluted rat away? I didn't know I had that either. I'll take it though. All right, all I'm worried about is acid. So, resources? Yeah, this is the acid extractor. All right, let's put that there. If I remember correctly, there's three of them. Let's put that there and that there. I think there's crystal here too, actually. Hold on. Yep, there's crystal here too. Fuck, dude. All I would have ever needed was this place, huh? Alright, so power generators. How many does this need? Ten. Fuck me. Alright, let's put that. Luckily. Oh, no. Um, maybe this will work? Yep. Are they both working? That one's working. That one's not working. All right, let's uh, let's build a tiny one. It 
It's still not working. It, did it work? Um, no. Fuck, dude, I'm like wasting resources here. Come on. Um, can I build two of these? All right. All right, let's move this a little bit further this way. Ooh. There we go. Now let's build some turrets. We'll put that there. Put that right there, I guess. Um. <coughs> sure. Wait, did I not put that up there? Oh yeah, I did. All right. Let's put one up here. We'll pull one up here. And I think we should be good for now. Oh no. So what's attacking? It sounds like my alerts. Oh fuck. Come on, baby. Alright, he's dead. Do these things give me acid? No, but I'll take the Meyer Lurk meat. Oh shit. Run! Can I go up here? No. I'm just here for the acid, alright? Just leave me alone, please. Oh, this one's still not powered. That's it? Fuck it, dude. I'll take it. Come on, put this down. Is this powered now? It is. Give me my acid! Dude, that took a long freaking time. What else is there here? There's gold. Don't really need gold. And crystal. I mean, I guess I could always do this. So I could get water, gold, crystal, acid, and food. Awesome! Awesome! I mean, we're pretty much good. So let's search these guys. This was a very easy defense, all things considering. So let's go ahead and get all the acid that we can. There we go. How much is it? Hold on, let me see. Um, crafting. Fuck, dude. Do I want to spend three on gear? Oh, wait, no. Screws. I don't really want to spend that. So, let's fast travel back to my place really fast. And see if I have enough acid. I think it might be four though, but... Um, who knows. What the fuck? Please don't die in front of my house. You're at the end of me. Um Is that all of them? Please give me some fusion cells. Yes. I guess I'm not very I'm not complaining. Um Hold on. Where is my camp? Who the hell is shooting? Well, she's probably gonna die. Alright, let's see if we can smelt this. Smelting. Alright, well, I could do one. Is that enough to fix my weapon, though? That is the question. Um. So. Inspect and repair. Workshop. 
Very nice. All right, cool. What is, what is that? And what is this? What the fuck? I mean, I should take that. What is shooting? You're at the end of me. Um. At least I got ammo. Wait, didn't I just pick up four ammo? Oh yeah, I did. All right, good. All right, well that's gonna have to do it for now, though. We definitely uh, went on a freaking trip, dude, just to fix our freaking weapon. But hey, it's okay though. Well, at least we got a system now. So in between videos, I'm going to essentially take over Hemlock Holes and just get a shitload of acid, man, because this extractor definitely gives me enough to to uh, maintain my weapon uh, as far as crystal goes but of course I need to smelt so I also need uh, what's it called acid so the good thing is that taking hemlock holes it has three acid places so it should be more than enough for a long time so if you enjoyed this video do me a huge favor drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed and I'll definitely catch you guys in the next one deuces Thank you.